हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू पीडियाट्रिक्स बाई डॉक्टर आनंद टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ चॉइस इज रेस्पिरेटरी सिस्टम एंड आई एल बी एल बी यू नो यूल बी हेयरिंग अ वॉइस एंड देन यू हैव टू टेल मी वॉट इज़ द बेस्ट यू नो थिंग कम्स टू योर माइंड सो लेट्स ऑल ऑफ अस लिसन टू दिस वॉइस ऑफ अ बेबी विच कैन हेल्प अस आउट इन लर्निंग क्लिनिकल नॉलेज एंड गेट टू अ गुड डायग्नोसिस सो आई एम ओपनिंग द वॉइस नाउ Okay, so what voice is this? What do you think? What can you make out? This is nothing but known as strider. Okay, what is strider? Strider. It is a abnormal. Can you make out? It is a abnormal inspiratory low pitch sound which exacerbates by crying or feeding. It is a abnormal. Okay, it is a inspiratory. It is a low pitch sound exacerbates by crying or feeding. That is the first point. It is usually a upper respiratory tract problem where you see the there is a narrow or obstruction at the upper airway tract. Okay, you know the upper airway tract, right? Like uh, the na- nasal cavity, pharynx, and the uh, the initial part of the larynx. So upper respiratory tract, right? What are the what are the causes of strider? The most common. See how do you approach such case? How do you approach a case of strider? A baby comes to you like this. So number one, you will we will be seeing whether the the strider it it inc- improves on supine position or it increases on supine position. If the strider increases on supine position and decreases on the prone position, you must think of laryngomalacia. Laryngomalacia is one of the one of the commonest causes of strider in children and in infants. And where where do you see omega shape epiglottis? At the other end, okay. At the same time, opposite. If the if the strider improves on supine and increases on pronation, okay, opposite. Then what will you think? You will think of croup, acute laryngotracheal bronchitis. Okay, this is important. You must know this. Okay. What are the other other causes of strider? The most commonest one is laryngomalacia. Then other are laryngo seal. Then you have laryngeal web. Could be any unilateral vocal cord paralysis. and also could be bilateral adductor paralysis of the cords these were the important causes of strider that's how you should approach a case of strider uh, you know clinically you can uh, you know strider is basically a, a sign you can say and uh, yeah that's it and if you're thinking about laryngomalacia per se uh, then of course to diagnose it you should uh, get a flexible laryngoscopy done to uh, to see the omega shape epiglottis and the treatment remains the observation and symptoms resolve spontaneously okay and and that's it that was all about strider in general uh, you have seen this uh, sound also you have heard this sound it is important and uh, thank you so much for the for watching this show and uh, for more such updates you can follow us on instagram and youtube by the name pediatrics by dr anand and at the same time you can join our free whatsapp group for pediatrics one liners important clinical cases for learning so that everyone is being helped uh, one by one so that we can diagnose cases better we can treat the children in our nation better and uh, thank you so much have a good day for the free uh, pediatric one liners whatsapp group if you want to join or telegram group if you want to join uh, you can uh, whatsapp us on 999987081 for international students you must apply plus +91 before the number thank you